Hello to all my friends out there and welcome to the Rhoda Stone Show. So what I decided to do was start out my videos with a little stockpile food, you know, my boxes, um, and let you guys see them. Okay, so in this box, I, I bought these cereals at Dollar Tree. I have Raisin Bran, uh, Rice Krispies, usually I have shredded wheat, I have some oatmeal, I have some granola, and then I have pancake mix. So this is kind of like uh, for breakfast. And here is the two boxes of pancake mix I bought today. And I have some uh, evaporated milk. I like about 20 cans. And I have two, two cartons of, um, of shelf-stable milk. And then I have some Cheerios. I also have more Cheerios, but um, I find the Cheerios are going to be working out pretty well. Uh, and there's a lot of cereal in these boxes. So that is my box of cereal. Uh, what I usually do when I stockpile is... Um, I like to stockpile uh, for cans, 20. You know more if you have a larger family. Okay, so now what I wanna make is a taco salad, and I have a really good taco salad recipe, and this is my the one I like, and the reason I like it is because it's it doesn't have very many ingredients, and it's easy to make. So um, last night, I had chicken, and so I have some chicken left, so I will make a chicken taco salad. And and so my my iceberg lettuce is hanging in there pretty well, I have to say. You know, I think I I prefer the heads of lettuce uh, on on. Uh, chopped uh, this way you know no one's been messing around as bad with your lettuce I've had this lettuce for quite a few days and it's, it's pretty good so I, I need some lettuce okay so I want to make myself a little a little salad I don't want to spend too much money why should I You know, if you can come up with a pretty decent meal uh, without spending too much money, uh, it's probably the smart thing to do. Okay, now back here. I'm going to have two beverages tonight. I had um, some lemon left, so what I did is I cut my lemon up in cubes, what I had left of it, and I um, boiled it with one quarter cup uh, I mean one quarter teaspoon of tartar. I keep it in the freezer. I don't want my cream of tartar getting messed up. Because it's one of those things when you need it, you kind of really need it. You know, so you want to be kind of careful with your cream of tartar. And then I have honey from Walmart. So this is my first beverage. And um, tonight, you know, after after I eat, I'll sit around and I will drink these beverages between now and tomorrow. I know you don't have to, but I like to keep my um, honey in the refrigerator. And then I have some chamomile tea. Uh, when I make this, I usually drink one, one cup. And then I save the rest and I drink it as iced tea. But I like this, this tea at night because there's no caffeine in it. 
and it's a very, very mild tea. And uh, I like to drink it with sugar. Sugar first, so you don't cool your tea before you add your. Okay, now this this lemon tea can be made with um, with lemons, with grapefruits, with oranges. I'm looking for my milk. Uh, with quamquat, any, let me see if this, sometimes I just drink my, my milk out of my creamer, you know, when I know it needs to be consumed. So this is good because I have plenty of vitamin C. So, okay, I have lettuce. And this is my leftover chicken. And this will be a good little taco salad here. Okay, um, I don't know, a few days ago, I bought some, uh, Mark, I bought some tomatoes, some apples, and some um, oranges marked down. And so what I did with the tomatoes is I made my own uh, stewed tomatoes, and all I did is I covered them with water and I boiled them in a little salt and I mashed them up and then I seasoned them with salt, pepper, and sugar and then I ate them and then I froze the rest and so tonight is the perfect night to use them up. Uh, what's good about these uh, fresh tomatoes, you can use, I mean these stewed tomatoes you make from uh, scratch is that you can uh, use them like fresh tomatoes. Okay, I put some, I had some frozen chives I had some cilantro, where is it? So I put that, I had some salt, some pepper, and and some taco seasoning. So mainly I just wanna make my um, chicken like a little bit, um, a little bit Mexican style. So once you have a good taco salad recipe, you can, uh, one, one of my customers was a Mexican chef and he told me you need you need some kind of onions in your Mexican food or it's just gonna be too blah. I found that to be true. Okay, then if you watch my video today earlier, I bought three of these cheeses at uh, Dollar Tree. These are a dollar. how much eight ounces these are uh, what would you call them uh, processed cheese so um, these will really stretch your budget I'm not saying eat entire um, processed cheese but like on this you know at night okay I pretty much can eat what I want but at night I, I want to control the fat and the sugar so what I want to do is control, control my, you know, fat and sugar at night. And then at lunchtime, I pretty much want to eat whatever I want to eat within reason. Over the next few, uh, over the next few uh, months, I will take off some weight. I'm not killing myself. I just want to lose a little weight. Not too much, just a little bit. Uh, I bought this, um, this is not real sour cream, but I, I bought it at Dollar Tree today. Uh, you know that $50 worth of stuff is really gonna save me money this month. That's what I did last month. It'll really save me money. Normally on this kind of salad, I would use Thousand Island, but since I have a, a ranch dressing opened up, I will just have ranch dressing. So, 
I have chicken instead of uh, ground beef. I have um, a green onion instead of onion. I, I haven't put the taco sauce on taco sauce on yet. I have sour cream. I have salt. I have lettuce. I have some um, cheddar cheese. I had some tomatoes that I had cooked, and I'm not having any any um, tortilla chips. I already had chips today. I already had chips today. I had chips for lunch. So what I'll do is I will just put a little bit on here. So I will be having more um, salads at night because um, you know they're they're not expensive. And now that I've come back to the iceberg lettuce, you know, I bought this lettuce, I don't know, several days ago for a dollar. And the cheese, this much cheese, cost me next to nothing. So, okay, you guys, God bless you all.